Hi, I'm Hunter, and this is Parse Explained. Today, we're explaining headlights. Beep, boop, bop, boop. Before headlights existed, people lit the way by good old candles. By the late 1880s, enclosed gas-powered lamps came onto the scene. Unlike candles, these lamps had the advantage of being resistant to the rain and the weather. In 1898, the electric vehicle company introduced the first electric headlamps, but were not widely adopted until the early 1900s. I know, I didn't know they made electric cars that early either. From the 1940s up until the early 80s, headlights in the US were pretty much the same from car to car. This was due to regulations that passed in 1940 standardizing all headlights. These early headlights were required to be a sealed design, meaning the bulb was fixed and permanently sealed into the rest of the light. You'll also notice the shape of these lights was standardized. This meant lights were not vehicle specific and were interchangeable from car to car. Sort of like the lights at your house. Just plug it in. Simple, right? Then in the early 80s, everything changed. In 1983, the US headlamp regulations were amended to allow replaceable bulbs and non-standard shapes. This meant that headlights could be molded to the specific shape of the car, allowing for sleek and modern aerodynamic designs. Also, this meant that headlights were going to get bigger and more complex. Modern vehicle headlights can be categorized by three different technologies, halogen, HID, and LED. Halogen headlights are the most common in today's vehicles and are generally the most affordable of all three technologies. The older your vehicle is, the more likely it is to have halogen lights. Halogen bulbs have a shorter lifespan than HID or LEDs and don't shine quite as bright. Similar to the incandescent bulbs used around your house, halogen lights used a wire filament that heats up and produces light when electric charge passes through it. The light emitted by halogen bulbs is characterized by a yellow hue. If your beams look like this, you likely have halogen lights on your vehicle. HID, or high intensity discharge lights, are another popular option. These bulbs produce the brightest light beams of the three technologies and are steadily catching up in popularity to halogens. Similar to halogen lights, HIDs produce light by passing current between two electrodes covered in a bulb with ionized gas. Like halogen, however, HID bulbs tend to have a shorter lifespan than LED. They're also gonna cost you a bit more than halogen. LED, otherwise known as light emitting diode lights, are the newest and a fast growing factory option. These lights are bright, energy efficient, and have the longest lifespan of all three technologies. As the cost of components falls, LEDs are becoming more popular. The light produced by LEDs is a bright white hue, depending on the color temperature of the diode. Although LED lights have the highest cost of all three, their durability makes them a smart choice. If you need headlights for your car, head to carparts.com. Have a part you want us to explain next? Comment below. This is Parts Explained.